devs. Oh my god, y'all, this is my cat. I think I mentioned her in like another episode, but like, oh my god, she's so precious. Look at her. Look at her. Oh god, she's so adorable. Hey, Tabs, say hello to the audience. She's not looking at the camera. Okay, that's fine. Tabs, say hi. She's not saying hi. Okay, she'll open up to y'all, I swear, but this is this is my cat. This is so precious. There's another cat in our house, but she's a bitch to me. So I still love her, but that's that's the tea, unfortunately. But yeah, this is my cat. Ah, I love her so much. Anyway, so let's get started with today's episode. Hello, all you lovely bitches. What's going on? My name is Ethan, and today we're back for more. This is for, of course, you know, quite on the video, so you would assume so. <laughs> you see the Sims 4 thumbnail, title, and now I'm playing like Call of Duty. <laughs> it's like, hi, welcome to Call of Duty. <laughs> Duty. Okay, that's, I'm sorry. I I think of the stupidest jokes, I swear. But anyways, hi, how's it going? I showed my, off my cat. My cat is lovely. She's, oh, no, she's gone. <laughs> she's somewhere. Oh, she's over here. Okay. She loves to look outside the window and see everything that's outside because she is one of those cats, or I guess all cats are like this most uh, for the most part, but... She loves watching a bunch of animals outside because they're all prey to her. <laughs> so <laughs> there is like victims. They're like, oh, she's like, I'm gonna kill them one day. I swear to God, I swear to God, that bird out there, mmm, tasty dinner. But unfortunately, she'll never have the chance. <sighs> I'm so sorry, Tabs. But anyways, uh, Rua is fucking smelly. Apparently, the roles have turned where Jim is no longer the smelly one. It's Rua all the time. So let's get his ass in the shower. Not watching whatever the hell he's watching. What's, what's he watching? The Clumsy Sisters. Okay, I know you, you can relate to them because they're clumsy as fuck. But like, <laughs> I mean, same. But get your ass in the shower, smelly bastard. So apparently, Rio doesn't work today. So what I'm going to do for him is make him work anyways. <laughs> is that awful? I just need money. I need a wedding to happen, y'all. I don't think you understand how much this wedding needs to happen. Maybe y'all are cheering for the wedding so much, as much as I am, but like, I need a wedding. Pronto. I don't think it'll happen this episode, but next episode, if we have enough money, we can get a whole wedding. We could elope immediately, but that's, this doesn't feel the same. There's no whole wedding, there's no whole event, so, I mean, what's the point? I mean, you can elope, it'll be great. And if you're just playing Sims, you know, constantly, there's no need to have weddings over and over. Especially how expensive they are. Like, Jesus. I mean, most people who play Sims just use cheats anyway. But I'm not about that life. Actually, do most people use cheats? Put in the comments below if you use cheats all the time. Or, or not. Interested to see. But. But. We're going to get this rolling. So, yeah. Take a shower faster, bitch. We got to get this episode rolling. Let's go. Thank you. I appreciate it. Let's find an odd job. Let's see what's happening. What's happening out there in the world. And apparently, Rua is super fucking smart, which I love because uh, Jim is... I almost said Jua. <laughs> oh, God. Rua. I mean, Jesus Christ. Jim. Jim is a fucking dumbass. So, I need this to happen. Um, Oh, my God. $106? bitch <laughs> i really oh my god we can get so much money off of this i think that's amazing comb beach for trash due by 4 p.m oh what that's stupid all right well that's fine i guess we only get 106 dollars out of this but we can just do this real quick i think because there's trash all over the place including jim he's kind of trashy but that's okay we love him anyways <laughs> but let's clean up this messy beach harvest fest starts tomorrow huh so the wedding might be postponed because it's Harvest Fest. Or we could have a Harvest Fest wedding, which would be really weird, but that's okay. <laughs> I wonder if anyone's had a wedding on Thanksgiving. They probably have. That's interesting, though. <gasps> pineapples. Bitch, I need some pineapples in my life. Give me those pineapples. I need them. I'm going to steal the pineapples on this, <laughs> on this land. Mark my words. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. That's not what we need to do. Also, apparently you hurt your finger. Oh, it's okay, Rua. You'll be fine. But let's harvest these freaking pineapples. Let's not clean up the uh, the trash that's obviously there because that doesn't give me money. <laughs> We're a selfish bastard. So let's beachcomb for trash because we love beachcombing for trash. It's wonderful. And let's get this bitch. He found one salmon. That's not what I wanted, but sure. <laughs> He's found a double sun's discount beach towel and a cake. Who the, who the fuck loses a cake at the beach? The fingers of Solani. What is he finding? Is it actually kind of amazing? He said, "Oh, perfect. Okay, stop helping the environment. We got our money. 
Lovely. We have $848. We love that. Is there another odd job we can do? Because that would be fantastic. Honestly. But we need to own two pieces of workout equipment, apparently. Which is annoying for his aspiration. So, that's a thing we have to do. Oh, well. It's okay. That's fine. It's not fine. A seagull snagged it? Oh, my God. I didn't even see that. Apparently, a, sne uh, a seagull fucking snagged the trash he got. <laughs> what the hell? But we are going to do... Oh, they're both the same amount of money. Okay. Um, let's do let's do a TV hookup help. Uh, I'm sure he just forgot to plug in some cables or some bullshit. So, that'll be fine. And he's, like, handing this level, like, two or something. But apparently, stuff starts at 2 p.m. today. So, let's get Ruo, like, back home. Or, you know what? Let's just get him uh, talking to someone. Because apparently, he's a socially distancing himself and that's i mean that's good to a certain extent you fucking bitch excuse you excuse you okay confront about wrongdoing you bitch god damn it why do you just throw that in the middle of the beach thank you jim i no no don't swim damn it <laughs> throw the hell away you ass you saw them do it you saw her throw the trash right on the beach you bitch damn yeah confront this bitch She's a, a litter bug, apparently. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, and Jin's uh, now joining the fight. All right. Well, let's get Jin to do some uh, mischievery because that will be great. But let's, let's do a, you know, a funny introduction. You know, let's get this. Let's get this bread, <laughs> as the cool kids say. And, oh, no, he's sad. Oh, no, it's okay. It's okay, Rua. Just just go do your, go do your thing. Also, this bitch is walking up. Yeah, you think you're tough shit. Screw you, bitch. Well, aren't you just a bitch? Oh, she's yelling at me. We, we came, we, we got closer. We got closer as friends because she was a mean bitch. How's that work? I have no idea. <laughs> What's well, pickpocket? Because I need some more money and it gets our mischief skill up. So we we always love pickpocketing. It's always great to do. Kids always pickpocket. Don't pickpocket. Don't do it. <laughs> Terrible idea. If I did it in real life, I would not pull it off. And it's also just an awful thing to do to someone. So don't do it. But for Jim's case, it's great for him. What is this? A noxious cloud? It's like a fart? <laughs> I have no idea what that is. What? Nosh I have no idea. Oh, oh, he's just telling her about like a poison cloud. You fucking bitch, stop doing that. Get out of here, H. <laughs> Jim is just enemies of everyone. <laughs> Fun fact. You always had to let my cat in my room because she's super indecisive and like whether she wants to be in a room or not. So I had to keep my door open and she wants to be like truly happy. But I can't really open my door when I'm recording because there's other people in the house, like my family. <laughs> and they're like doing work stuff and whatnot. So I don't want to be yelling cuss words in, <laughs> throughout the entire house, especially when they're on Zoom meetings. But I don't know why I said Zoom meetings like that. Zoom meetings. <laughs> okay, you bitch, stop it. Also, why is Jim being a good person? Damn it. Jim, you're supposed to be evil. What are you doing? <laughs> Litter that back. Rua's had too much of an influence on Jim. God damn it. Actually, what are Rio's traits? I have no idea. Let's look it up real quick. He apparently is a child of the islands. We love that. He's clumsy, loves the outdoors, high metabolism, which is great. And he's a gym rat. So we love all that. But Jim is an evil bastard. And <laughs> literally, this is like the polar opposite. He, Rio is like a pure person. And Jim's just this fucking asshole who's <laughs> a glutton, evil kleptomaniac. So, and he's dastardly. <laughs> so funny. Can't pickpocket it again. Oh, apparently we already pickpocketed her. <laughs> oh my god. That's, I don't even see when it happens. I'm so sad. I never got to see Jim pip, uh, try and pickpocket uh, Santa. Oh, I know I did. I did. That one time at that Humor and Hygiene Festival, like two episodes ago, uh, I got Jim to try and <laughs> pickpocket Santa, and it didn't really work out. So uh, Santa started yelling at us, and I was like, oh, I'm just trying to pickpocket Santa. What do you mean? <laughs> What's the problem, dude? great success not only did rua hook up the tv but he also hooked up the surround sound love that the client couldn't have been more pleased in gratitude they bestowed upon rua master of electronics <laughs> the gift of a cookie and a tip after all the master of electronics demands a tip as tribute apparently rua is now a master of electronics a handy in this scale like level two which is <laughs> hilarious or three was it two yeah and like the very beginning of a level two too so <laughs> two two so oh he's going to admire the picture of dirk so they're both <laughs> rua and jim are both avid fans of dirk the celebrity apparently which is amazing <laughs> it's so funny with a bat <laughs> a baseball bat right beneath the picture <laughs> oh my god uh why is this oh, god damn it why is this broken why is everything like breaking this house now i hate that <laughs> it's so annoying 
I can't see me loving nobody but you for all my life. When you're with me, baby, the skies would be bright for all my life. Was that actually the lyrics? Wait, I need to look that up. I love that song, by the way. It's so cute. But like, was that, was that actually the lyrics? I first heard that in like that 70s show, and I love that show. I love that, I love that show so much. It's better than the Friends, in my opinion. Just saying. But what, what was I doing? Right, the lyrics. Jesus, I get, I'm like all over the place when I'm trying to speak. <laughs> in case y'all haven't noticed. Oh, I kind of had the lyrics right. Although I messed up like the second line thing I was doing. It's like, when you're with me, baby, the skies will be blue. I said bright. The skies, maybe the skies will be bright. Whatever that means. <laughs> it, it'll be bright. The sun will be out. It'll be in your face. It's going to blind the fuck out of you. Oh, wow. We're doing like the best we can for our job. Jim is moving up in the ranks in the criminal world. He's a minor crime lord. I didn't even realize that. Holy shit, Jim. That's amazing. <laughs> An evil celebrity, truly. But he is fully ready. He is super hydrated. Why are his scales dry? He's fucking hydrated. What do you mean? Get back in the house and eat some food, goddammit. Oh, he's in the hot tub. I didn't I forgot we had a hot tub. <laughs> we could totally use this to hydrate. I should totally do that for Jim. That'd be so useful. It's literally right outside the bedroom. I love that. Also, Rua is like... Uh, a little hot, you know, but I, you know, <laughs> I'm hot shit. He's, <laughs> that was the best I've ever seen, Rua. That's so funny. They have a really nice bedroom, though. Like, I kill for this bedroom, seriously. But this is a really nice bedroom, too. What are you doing? <laughs> Don't eat the poo. What are you, ew. Okay, he's throwing it away. That's fine. But, like, eat the leftovers, you idiot. I told you to go eat. And, and you just, okay, the poo magically turned into this, like, pile of crap. You gotta have a whole apple tree in the front. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's so funny. It looks so cool though. I love that. I wish I could have like put it over here though. I mean I could have but like I didn't. Can I move it right now? Because it's kind of like weird when it's right there. I already have the trash plan. It's bad enough. What if I do that? Perfect. I moved it. Okay. Love that. Uh, the trash plan will, will forever stay because that's just a thing now. <laughs> it's just a thing. But um, I don't need like all these plants in my front porch. So, Oh wait, the stairs. I need to. Oh, they cost like 800 fucking dollars though. They're so expensive. Okay, well they're gonna have to they're gonna have to live with the one staircase for now. Like seriously, staircases are fucking expensive, y'all. I swear to God, it's too much, too much. All right, Jim, I know you're enjoying your goddamn fruit salad, but holy shit, go to work. <laughs> He's very confident though, so we love that. Uh, pet training, yes, we love that. So Jim's off to work. He's in a fancy crime lord suit. I love that. He looks a little weird, but not gonna lie. But Bear has run through the obstacle course with Rua, which I love. Rua, do this shit. Do this shit. Champion pet. Oh, it's so cute. Okay, run run the obstacle course again. I want to see this. <laughs> it's so goddamn cute. And then we're going to get Rua to bed. It'd be great. All right, Bear, let's do this. Yes, we love this. Green lit. Let's go. Come on, Bear. Oh, he's going through the fire. No, Bear, what are you doing? Go through the fire. What? You just said no. <laughs> Okay, whatever. I mean, I don't blame you. It's a fucking ring of fire, but like, come on, bear. Also, like, lit green, so I thought he was gonna, like, succeed, but that's okay. Come on, bear. You can do this. Yes. 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 Yes! Oh my god, bear. Okay, so you want to go through the little ring of fire, but you want to the giant one? That makes no sense, but whatever. You do you. Oh, it's our friends now. Oh, it's so cute. Ah! Okay, I love that. I just want bear to get, like, a gold medal in this course because it's amazing. But, and Bear's amazing. I love Bear so much, y'all. And he's getting a tree. Ah, oh, Bear's the best, honestly. Bear is the best sim out here. Here. What the hell? Who are you? Okay, whatever. You do your thing, weird ass. <laughs> Who the fuck was she? I'm concerned now. Do we do we have the doors locked? Hold up. I don't know if robbers are like a, uh, like a thing in this game. Also, apparently this wasn't set as the front door until just now. I did not realize that, <laughs> but let's lock this. Everyone but household members. Yes. And let's lock this. Lock door for everyone but household members. Why would you lock it for everyone? I feel like the door would be useless at that point. <laughs> like seriously. Oh wait, that, that's gonna be useful if we wanna kill a sim. Just saying. But that's lovely. Uh, Rua's gonna be sad when that sim dies, whatever. <laughs> Whoever the victim's gonna be. I have an idea who the victim's going to be. <laughs> you already know Makoa's under the hit list of Jim. 
but Jim's doing his crime lord job. Let's get some money. He swiped an object and he got $192. We love that. Love that so much. So I think after one more time he goes to this job. Oh, okay. We're running the obstacle course. I don't know why we're doing that. That is interesting. Let's see how this goes. Come on, bear. Yes, he did it. Yes. Oh my God. You are amazing. You are the best dog ever. Uh, two hours and four minutes later, bear finally did the obstacle course. Holy shit. <laughs> I love you, bear, but that took way too long for you. <laughs> Jesus. We're going to get Jim to sleep and call this day a day. <laughs> All right, that is it for today's episode, y'all. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And next time, next time, it's Harvest Fest, and we're going to see if we get that wedding underway. So, yeah, drop a like or a dislike if you want, whatever you prefer. I'll see you all next time. Bye.